What? Ah. See, now that is an innovation in itself. You know, one of the things I love about technology, it doesn't always have to do with science. Sometimes it even tastes good. What? Do you guys remember hearing stories from your grandparents or your parents about pop shops? Now, pop shops were places that people used to go to, sit at the countertop, and order any flavor soda that they want. Now that tradition is slowly faded, but I found a father and son team who's bringing it back. We're here at Dog and Good Soda, and we're gonna see what they're up to. Bill, Rob, very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, young man. My son, Michael. Hi. Michael, very nice to meet you. Nice you too. All right, so tell me what you guys are whipping up in here. We actually have our own little bottling system here. We make a vintage soda with pure cane sugar the way it used to be made. So you guys are literally taking that vintage style of soda making and bringing it back to us right now. And it's in glass bottles. It's handcrafted. How did this whole process even get started? Michael and I, in 2008, we opened up a restaurant sandwich shop, and I wanted to sell energy drinks in chocolate milk. That's what I thought the kids <laughs> would drink. And I decided, well, I'm just gonna get some soda. And I went to LA, bought six or seven cases of soda and filled up one door. And within a week, his was all gone. Three weeks later, the code dates were gone with my product. <laughs> we threw it out. And you're like, I think we're on to something right. here. Yeah. So tell me how this machine actually works. Okay. This is the heart of the system. At this point, the water and everything is under pressure. You have the bottle where you have syrup at the bottom. Then we blast it with CO2 gas, and then we add carbonated water. It shuts off automatically, and the pressure's released. You got a bottle of soda. And how long does that whole process take? About 30 seconds. 30 seconds? Yes. To make a vintage style classic soda of any flavor you want. With pure cane sugar. We can make orange, vanilla cream, strawberry cream. We, we, any kind of soda that you really would be interested two, in. Two together, watermelon. This is, this is like reminding me of Willy Wonka and, and the soda factory now, is sort of what I'm gonna call this. Oh man, I like that. <laughs> okay, Bill, so tell me how we're starting this process out. Pick your flavor. Okay. We have red currant, sarsaparilla, cherry cola, cola, uh, vanilla cream. Which I, one would you like? You know, I think let's go traditional. Let's go with cola. All right, cola it is. You can put the bottle in the machine. Bottle machine. <laughs> what do I do next? Let's, let's put a cap on it. You want to tumble it? Get it yeah, mixed just tumble a little it, bit. Mix, there it is. Look at that. Let's go over here and dip it in some wax. There you go. Perfect soda every time. That was super easy. Thank you for having me. And you know what? The only thing that we have to do left is enjoy the soda.